Now we all have dreams. We all have hopes of the future. We need to hope in the future. We need to have faith. We need to put that faith and trust in ourselves. Invest in ourselves. Invest in our dreams. Too many people don't live their dreams because they don't know what dreams they dream. Or if they have dreamed dreams, they have forgotten them and given up on their dreams. In most cases, it takes no effort to dream. From the days when we were children, we had dreams and visions of the future. We had hopes. We had our own inspiration. And that inspiration would take us on a journey. Every day we wake up. Welcome to Music, Motivation, and More, the Positivity Podcast. I am your host, Gerald Simon. I am the founder of Music Motivation and the creator of the Cool Song Series and the Essential Piano Exercise Course. And I'm excited to have you listen to the show today. Today's podcast is titled, Building Your Dream Dynasty. And I'd like to start by reading from my book, Perceptions, Parables, and Pointers, on page 18, where it talks about how everyone should dream. This is what it says. Everyone should dream. I'm not talking about daydreaming or hoping for something you and I know will never happen unless you do something about it. I'm talking about dream encoding. When someone actively participates in dream encoding, he begins to encode his dreams deep into his DNA, so to speak, of course. He focuses so intently on his dreams on a conscious level that his subconscious not only accepts the dreams as a reality, but the dreamer begins to create a dream blueprint for accomplishing his dreams. An action plan is then put into motion, and their dream timeline has a deadline and various completion checkpoints along the way. Dream encoding is the process of turning your dreams into reality. They become part of you. Dreams are active entities and continue to grow and change as you grow and change. Our dreams foster other dreams. One dream leads to another in a never-ending and continually perpetuating dream dynasty. The offspring of our current dreams produce dreams of their own if we encourage them and give them the room they need to grow. Dreams are very delicate and can easily be destroyed. Dreams require constant attention and nurturing care. Protect your dreams. Care for them. Help them grow and give them strength. Now we all have dreams. We all have hopes of the future. We need to hope in the future. We need to have faith. We need to put that faith and trust in ourselves. Invest in ourselves. Invest in our dreams. Too many people don't live their dreams because they don't know what dreams they dream. Or if they have dreamed dreams, they have forgotten them and given up on their dreams. Right now I'd like to read the motivation in a minute for today. This is on page 174 from the book Perceptions, Parables, and Pointers. This is a quote by President Woodrow Wilson. This is what it says. We grow great by dreams. All big men are dreamers. They see things in the soft haze of a spring day or in the red fire of a long winter's evening. Some of us let these dreams die. But others nourish and protect them, nurse them through bad days till they bring them in the sunshine and light which comes always to those who sincerely hope that their dreams will come true. Right now I'd like to have us listen to a composition I composed from one of my meditation relaxation albums. This is titled Dreamcatcher. And it's from my album, Chasing Clouds, which features relaxation, meditation music I created for anyone, but primarily for 
holistic practitioners and spas, chiropractors, massage therapists, those who are constantly trying to create a mood or ambience to help individuals relax. So let me have you listen to Dreamcatcher. For the poetry that motivates portion of this podcast, I would like to read a poem I wrote from my book, The As If Principle, Motivational Poetry. This poem is titled, Dare to Dream. Dare to dream, envision the good you will do. Dare to believe, it's instilling faith in you. Dare to learn, to become a student of life. Dare to be tolerant, to live with peace and avoid any strife. Now those are simple words, dare to dream. So simple, in fact, 
that I believe we often overlook their simplicity. It's not that I'm daring individuals to dream. In most cases, it takes no effort to dream. From the days when we were children, we had dreams and visions of the future. We had hopes. We had our own inspiration. And that inspiration would take us on a journey. Every day, we wake up from our dreams and we live a reality. Now, that reality is a reality of our own creation. It's life. It's real life. And yet there are individuals, and we look at them sometimes with envy, sometimes jealous, sometimes hoping and wishing that our lives could be more like their lives. And it's not that their lives are any better than ours, but it's because of what these individuals have been able to accomplish. They thought of doing something, whatever it was, and then they began to work to put forth the effort to make their dreams become a reality. And that is the difference. We all have dreams. We all have hopes. We all pray for certain things in our lives and in the lives of our children. Those dreams that we dream, those ambitions we have, those hopes we hope for, those thoughts we think, those beliefs we believe, to come into life, they require work, dedication patience. It's an investment. It's time well spent grinding at the stone. You see, if we don't put in the practice, how can we be prepared to perform what we have not practiced or rehearsed? Often we look at others and we see what they have accomplished, what dreams they have dreamed, and we look at them and we want the outcome. But we don't necessarily want to put in the time and effort required to produce the results. See, the dream is the first step. Dream encoding, as I referred to earlier, is the process of creating a path. It's that dream dynasty we are hoping to create where our dreams foster new dreams. And then those dreams continue to grow. They change, they improve as we grow, as we change, as we improve. The dream dynasty is that regardless of how old we may be, regardless of what experiences or inexperiences we have had in life, regardless of what successes or failures we have seen from day to day, regardless of our intelligence or our ignorance, we all have dreams. The dream encoding is the process by which we create a blueprint. It's a map to help our dreams come true. It is my hope that we do that, that we begin the process to bring our dreams to life. I hope you have a wonderful day today. Make all of your dreams come true. It's a process. It starts out small, and then it begins to snowball and grow. Dreams are powerful things. Don't ever let your dreams die. Do what it takes to turn your dreams into a reality. Thank you for listening to this podcast. I hope you have a wonderful day. Make your dreams come true starting today. So smile all the while. Be happy. Be positive. Do your best today and continually strive to be better each and every day. That we may be better today than we were yesterday. And that tomorrow we will be better than we were today. Hope you guys have a wonderful week. Thanks for listening. Bye. Subscribe to Music, Motivation, and More, the Positivity Podcast, to receive updates of each new weekly podcast produced and released by Gerald Simon. Every Monday, a new podcast is released to help motivate and inspire individuals to learn, to grow, to do, to be, and become the very best they can become. These are all motivational messages that inspire men and women of all ages to do and be their best, to set goals, 
to work on improving who they are and who they would like to become. Thank you again for listening. Connect with us on social media to become part of the conversation as we all work together to motivate each other to do and be our best. A new podcast is recorded and released on Mondays. Listen on any podcast platform of your preference. But I'd love to have you listen to my music as well. You can listen to my music and find my artist name, Gerald Simon, J-E-R-A-L-D-S-I-M-O-N. You can listen on Spotify, on Pandora, Apple Music, Amazon, all the different streaming platforms. I would love to have you check out my YouTube channel. It is youtube.com slash Gerald Simon, J-E-R-A-L-D-S-I-M-O-N. I have motivation in a minute and poetry that motivates videos that I have produced in addition to my own music videos and music educational instructional tutorials that I've created to help teach music the fun way. I'd love to have you check it out. I'd love to connect with you on social media. You can connect with me on any social media platform. You can go to facebook.com slash Gerald Simon. I'm also on Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, all the different social pages, at Gerald Simon, J-E-R-A-L-D-S-I-M-O-N. But I'd love to have you check out my music. Let me know what you think. Thanks for listening. Hope you guys have a great day.